Once you log into your My Connect2Go account using a mobile device, you'll notice it takes you to a status page. This is partition status as well as zone activity. By clicking on the arm button, you'll see that it gives you the option to arm with a code, do a star nine arm with a code, and if you scroll down to the bottom of that page, you'll also see you can arm without codes. You can arm away and stay. In this example, we used arm stay, and you can see that now the command is in queue. If I refresh this page, after about a minute, you'll see that now the system says there's an exit delay. After about another minute, when the page is refreshed, you'll now see that the alarm is on. It is stay armed. And to disarm the system, simply click on the disarm button, which will take you to this page. Type in your code and click disarm. Then you'll see the disarm is now in queue to be sent to your security system. And after about a minute, your system is now ready again. Beside the arm button is the command button. Press on this icon and it'll take you to this page where you can use it for programmable outputs, also bypassing zones. You can send custom sequences to your device. And at the very bottom, you can see that you can reset or reboot your security module from this page. At the bottom of the status page, you'll see zone activity. And if the squares are red, that means that zone has been recently opened or closed. And if you click on that area, it'll take you to a listing of all zones and the activity in relation to that zone. If you click on the events button at the bottom of the page, this will take you to a list of everything to do with your security module. That would be any arming, any disarming, any power failures at your residence or business, or maybe even a network supervision fault, meaning you've lost internet. Under the HVAC button at the bottom, if you have HVACs installed, it will show up on this page as well. And the final feature is under cameras. If you have security cameras set up with your My connect to go account, simply just click on the camera that's listed in your account and that will take you to a live view of that camera on your mobile device.